Hello there, the sun is shining. It's about 8.30. Today's my birthday and I'm going to get my hair done. Um, it's just got some scragglies and it looks really dry on the bottom. And it's been, you know, growing out really weird. So I just wanna go get a trim and she may color it, I don't know. I let her kinda do what she wants to do. I just tell her like no red, cause I already have some red on my face and I just don't wanna, don't wanna do that. Um, so yeah, we're gonna go get my hair done. We got all the kiddos in the back. Say hello. Hello, Goldie. Yeah. He, he just woke up. I had to wake him up actually. Um, but yeah, we better get on the road or we're not gonna make it. It's about an hour or so away. Uh oh, and Colton wants us to get moving. Uh, so I just thought I'd just take you along, show you what we do for my birthday. I don't know what we're gonna get into today. I just know I have a hair appointment for this crazy hair. And um, we'll see what happens after that. Here are my results. I still have my, you know, baby hairs up here, but she did a little lighter pieces in here. I think it looks pretty good. So uh, we went and had sushi for our lunch, and now we are uh, here in the driveway. But I got, I went by the mailbox, and we got our love every play kit so it may be my birthday but colton's gonna get a little little thing we're gonna open it when we get home so maybe it'll keep him busy and i can just relax tonight before i have to make dinner i think for dinner we're gonna do like a zuppa toscana soup now it was cooler when I'd planned this, but it's like almost 100 degrees today. I thought fall was almost here. Now, the next three days are gonna be really hot, and then it's gonna cool down again. So we're having soup on a hot day, but it'll be all right. But it's like a sausage, kale, and potato soup, and it's really good. And I also got some French bread the other day, so we'll just kind of toast that up and have it with it, and it's gonna be delicious. This one came with a little notes to my child letters for a future you because he's about to turn one at the end of October. But look, it's like little envelopes that you can write letters to your baby and give them to him later. So sweet. This is the guide that tells you how to introduce things and how to play with your baby. So it comes with this little book. It, every single one of them has books in it, but this one has a little tiny book. So that'll be fun. And then we've got a little organic cotton baby doll, which he already likes Audrey's baby doll. So I think he's gonna like that. He has one on his own now. Then this one came with like these sensory balls. One of them is very heavy and one of them is really light. And we've got an organic cotton sensory pouch so he can hide things in there. And it's crinkles at the bottom. Oh, and he got a puzzle. This one will use that pincher grasp, which he's gotten really good at. Um, but a little, another little puzzle. He got a puzzle in one of his older ones, but it was more of a flat, easier to use puzzle. What's this? And then we've got a sliding top box. He'll really like that, I think. Um. And then 
this is a little wooden peg drop so there's little wooden pegs in here and he will play with that Each other. 